Hi guys, so today I thought I'd talk about something that's been on my mind for like maybe the past few months, near a year now, and it's that, well, I feel lost in life right now. I'm, I'm sure a lot of people who are my age or near my age feel lost in their life right now. It's like something that's been going on a little more lately for most, most people who are in my generation. People from like early 20s to late teens and maybe even actual teens like maybe you're in high school and you don't know what to study in college yet so you're just unsure I've, I've been down that road as well I feel you for all my life I've wanted to be an actor and as of right now I'm, I'm 20 turning 21 and the way I've been living is I've been working a part-time job since I graduated from Toronto Film School College uh, I've been working a part-time job, uh, almost full-time, that's like, as of right now, my hours, at Enterprise Rent-A-Car as a car detailer. That's just what I've been doing for now, and I do have a talent agent for acting. Uh, he's the best. He sends me auditions pretty often. I'm doing them as much as I can. So, as of right now, that's just been my life, working a part-time job at Enterprise Rent-A-Car, and uh, taking acting classes as well, and taking uh, start doing auditions as well, hoping eventually... I'm, I'm praying to God this year I book auditions I haven't really booked anything yet and I am starting out I've, I've only really started to take acting seriously when I was 18 and I'm 20 now and I'm just hoping that like down the line I can start like things start to pick up I'm not gonna throw in the towel yet and I know like um, we're all at that we all get to that point in life sometimes where we're not, we're not gonna give up but it's it's tempting it's just like is it even worth persevering anymore? Like, I'm doing everything right. I'm being told to take acting classes, which is exactly what I'm doing. I'm also working a survival job, that's what we call it. Like, I still live at home, as you can, this is my bedroom. I still live at home with my parents, and you know, I, I'm comfortable here. I'm, I'm still, like, that's another thing. I'm nowhere near the age of moving out on my own yet. I'm only 20, turning 21. I'm nowhere near that point. And I don't want to. I don't want to live on my own yet. Anyways, like I said, I have a comfortable life here at home. But you know, I'm helping my parents out, giving them money and stuff. I'm helping them with chores and whatever, with whatever they need. And I'm also, yeah, I'm just saving up for as many acting classes as I can, so I can continue to build my resume and also get experience, so that I can hopefully make acting my full time career. That's like. Like I said, that's the only career I've ever wanted, but I just feel like I'm kind of trapped in a loop right now where I'm working a part-time job that I don't hate. I don't hate enterprise. I just like, it's not the job I want to pursue forever. I'm, I'm not going to go through my whole life being a car detailer. So I'm just working there, taking acting classes and doing auditions until I make it. And it's just, it's this, this trend has been going on for so long to the point where I'm wondering if it's even worth persevering anymore. And I already know the answer to that. Yeah, it is worth persevering. And I'm not about to give up. I'm not going to throw in the towel yet. It's just like after a while, that loop gets very tiring. And, um, I don't know, that's how I feel. So I just hope eventually this can all start working out. And some of my friends, not all of them, but a few of them, they feel the same way as me. You know, they're not sure what they want to do with life they're fresh out of university or college or they're still in university and college they're not sure what job they want to get and um you know they don't want to work a, a shitty job that they don't enjoy but it pays the bills like that's another thing life is way better than that and that's why i want to be act that's why i want to be an actor that's like that's the career i'm passionate about it's the only job ever i've ever wanted in my life i don't want to work a job that i don't like just for the purpose of paying the bills or supporting a family even. And not that I'm at that point in life either, but yeah, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm over, I'm over stressing about life. I'm overthinking everything. Again, I'm only 20 years old, turning 21 this year. I know I get the constant reminder. Oh, you're a baby. You're, you're so young. I don't always feel that way. Life moves so fast. Like that's, that's, that's just another thing like life moves so fast yes like it just it feels like yesterday i was at elementary school in grade eight in, in the classroom like not having to worry about life that feels like yesterday but with a snap of a finger here i am turning 21 this year uh working a job that for now like i i don't feel like i know my parents aren't disappointed in me but sometimes i do feel like i disappointed them by working 
you know, a shitty, not, it's not shitty, but it's, you know, a little bit above minimum wage part-time job as of right now. Not that I don't enjoy it. I mean, I enjoy it a lot. I like my bosses and my coworkers and my colleagues. But again, it's not the job I'm going to be at forever. That's for sure. I just don't know how much longer this this loop, like I said, is going to last. Like, am I going to be in this position for the next year? Will it be done this year? Will it be there for the next two years? Working a part-time job and taking classes? I, I don't know. And, and, and doing auditions? I, I don't know. I just hope it ends soon. That's all. I know this isn't going to be forever, and I know I'm so young, but... I can't help but stress about it, and same as a lot of my friends and a lot of people my age. But yeah, back to the point of life moving so fast, just like, everything feels like yesterday now. After I became a teenager, like, I think after the age of like 13 or 14, everything started moving fast. Like, friends come and go, friends come and go, co-workers come and go, jobs come and go. I've been through so many part-time jobs in the past five years, like from 2018, okay, no, six years. In the past six years, I've been through, let's see one two three four f sorry no uh four five i i i don't even feel like counting right now i've been through like six part-time jobs at, all at restaurants actually as well and i'm not close to a lot of my co-workers anymore from any of these places but back then like it feels like yesterday i saw them you know and they were kind i liked i liked all of my co-workers from all of my places they were all great I, st I still sometimes talk to some of them. I have their Instagrams and Snapchats, of course. But, like, you know, we're not close anymore. And, like, I do wish it kind of... I, I guess... I do wish it, it didn't move so fast, but eventually I know I have to move on. And that, like... I was never going to be at any of those jobs forever. And I'm never... I'm not going to be at Enterprise Rent-A-Car forever, either. So, I guess that's all I really have to say. I guess the final verdict of this entire thing is just that, like... I gotta be patient, I gotta persevere. It is worth persevering, that's the lesson. And it's not like I'm doing nothing, like I said. I'm working, I'm improving myself every day. I'm taking classes, I'm not sitting on my ass every day. And yeah, if I just keep doing everything the best that I can, I, I'm sure I will have a successful acting career. And I'm sure whatever you're pursuing as well, you'll be successful in. So, yeah, I guess that's it then. All right. Well, you guys have a great night. Take care now. Peace.